Hey, it's Dave Knight here from 123daytrade.com. Thank you for watching. Thank you for being here. Today was Friday. Friday, Friday, August 2nd, 2019. You know I'm going to try to keep it to five minutes, but can't guarantee I'm going to be able to do it. I just recorded a video just a second ago, and I, I was going on for a little rambling. Um, cheers. <clears throat> How'd I do this week? Um, the, on last Friday, I ended the week at $763.20. This week, I finished my Friday trading at $1,637.7. On the pro funded account here at Top Step Trader TST. For the week, I was up $874.50. Um, I was up over, with less commission cost, I, I, I believe I was up over a thousand bucks. And then the commission cost, well, maybe not that high, but $874, averaging three to five trades. Oh, let's just say I was averaging three trades a day, 15 times 3.7. No, I was probably around 950 less commission cost today, somewhere in that area. All right, so what's going on? My trading's been boring lately, and maybe that's the way it should be. I've cut my trading down as far as uh, opportunities. The... Um, I've made up my mind that if I lose between 30 to 35 ticks, I'm going to quit on the day and live to fight for the, another, the next day and trade the next day. Kind of like I did last week, I went down minus 32 and the next day I ended up plus 50. So there's always tomorrow, at least that's uh, the way that I'm looking at it right now. Thursday was probably the biggest day as far as trading goes, but most of that movement happened after Trump talked and, and basically after in the afternoon when I'm not trading. So that $2 move, Thursday was probably the closest I was to having a big trading day. Monday I had plus 50 ticks and I think I had like Yesterday I was at like plus 26 or 28, if I'm not mistaken, and the other three days were pretty much break even on the on the trading days. So I, I just go to break even quickly. Take don't allow the market to go that far against me. Um, some of the video content I put up this week showed how I handled the trading. I believe I showed. Monday's trading and I believe I showed Thursday's trading how I went after both those days so you know go look at those two videos if you're looking at my recap as far as the recap for the week I just talked about it it was a, a good week overall I uh, two weeks in a row positive I mean that's kind of the overall goal to be positive I came in today hoping I'd, I would finish up over a thousand um, I wasn't able to do it today, but I finished up, what did I say, $874.50. I took four stabs at it today, and I finished up eight ticks today, so 80 bucks less commission costs. So my best opportunity, to, I believe, came on the second trade. Uh, I was short going into it, and the market fell for a bit, and I, it looked like it was, you know, bottom was coming out, and it just stopped. And then I went long on the next two trades, and neither one of those two worked out. They came back to knock me out. Um, so I'm not taking a lot of... I'm moving quickly to break even is what I'm doing. If you're asking me what I'm doing, I'm, I'm not allowing myself a lot of, of time to sit back and say, all right, is this market going to go against me? I go to break even. If it runs me out, then I look for another opportunity if there is one with volume or with no interest in a new level. For instance, we talked about four points of contact, I think, either Monday or last week, something like that. Um, honestly, uh, my, my trading's been, been boring. 
Uh, we're at the five minute mark right now. So that's uh, my ti egg timer up there is not, must not be going as quick as the time here on the clock. So I do want to give a shout out to, uh, he called, he, on my channel, he calls himself Dan right now, but his real name, uh, I won't give him his real name, but his initials are JV. And I saw his uh, uh, withdrawal from Top Step Trader. You know, two thumbs up, actually, bam, bam, bam. Uh, awesome job out there. Uh, so um, give me something to look forward to. So I'm building my pro-funded account to the $5,000 level. Once again, my plan is to take away 2000 make turn it into real money, and trade on the 3000 So once again, if I didn't say it before, I finished up $874.50 on the week. I'm at sixteen thirty-seven and change, one thousand six hundred and thirty-seven bucks, and I'm building my account up to the five thousand dollar level. So all there's really that's all that that's really all I got to say today. I hope you had an awesome week. Uh, I look forward to talking to you if uh, it makes sense. You know, go to my website at one two three daytrade.com. Go over to the about. You see my email right there. I an I answer all my emails. Uh, and occasionally I'll answer comments down below if you don't piss me off. <laughs> That's about it. All right, all right, all right. Um, my channel's been boring lately, so it's a. I guess uh, I've, I'm turning a corner. At least that's the. At least that's what I hope I've done. I've I've, I've slowed my trading down, taken less entries, taken better entries. I quit trading on a negative day and don't get anywhere near the $500 max daily loss. All right, Dave Knight here from 123daytrade.com. Thank you for watching. Thank you for being here. Uh, by the way, I think Top Step Traders are running some pretty good specials right now. Take a look. Bye for now.